In today's video, I'm going to show you how I prep my ceilings in order for them to be tiled. We're going to be using GoBoard and we're also going to be using their washer and screw combo instead of, oh, let me show you, instead of their regular screw, which is this one uh, with the bigger flange head. Okay. Step number one, we have our shim kit right here. We're going to check to see, because uh, we want the ceiling to be level okay, and flat. That way, when we're installing our walls, all our cuts at the, at the top are going to be the same size. But first of all, I got to see how I'm going to lay my board because I got to put a shim every place where I'm going to put a screw. The screws go every 12 inches when you're using washers and screws. And on the ceilings, you have to use washer and screw all the time. So we have 42 by 42. I'm going to run 36 from this corner to about here. And then I'm gonna put a rip right here. So I'm gonna mark every one, two, three feet, and then at the end, and then I'm gonna mark it on every stud. We're gonna add a shim, and then we're gonna hang our board. First thing we're gonna do is I have this stand for my laser, so that way I can put it on the wall. I got a screw up here, I hope you guys can see it. And I'm just gonna hang it there. Turn it on. All I need is the top beam that goes 360 all the way around the bathroom. And then using the built with foam gauge, um, you see how it has wall. Okay, in this case, wall means the ceiling. So we're gonna use it like this. I'm gonna find the part of the ceiling that's actually hanging the lowest and that's gonna be our zero. So I'm just going to start at a random spot and sear it out and then check, oh, see like here, it's even lower. So I'm going to zero it again. So if it goes past my zero, we're good. It just means we need a shim. If it goes the other way towards the wall, it means that part is lower. So right now our zero is there. We're good. The lowest part of our ceiling is here, okay? So that's gonna be zero. And then where we marked for our, for our shims, I'm gonna bring, take it here, and then whatever color shim we need, we're gonna add it, okay? So this is our lowest part of the ceiling. Check it out, is that zero, right? Now we're gonna take it over here. Here's a mark where we need a shim. Now we put it there. It's more, this is actually five eighths higher, right? Because we need to be at zero down here. So we need to add a shim. We don't have a five eighths shim, so we're gonna be adding a half and then a one eighth. We're gonna go all the way around. Then by the time we put our shim, we should be able to check it and get to zero. If everything all around the ceiling is at zero, that means we're level and we're ready for Okay, so now we're done putting the shims up. This was actually pretty bad. But if we take our gauge and we go to every single location, now it's going to go back. Now we can hang our board and we can have a flat and level ceiling.